you know, I've always thought of Ben Stiller as a pretty serious director, even when he was doing broad comedies. I always thought he had something to say. And I always thought he was very good, but I think a lot of people see Ben Stiller's name on this and they say, how is that possible? Where is the guy who directed The Cable Guy coming from to direct something like this? I stand by The Cable Guy, personally. But uh, what did you think when he first approached you guys and said, I'm doing a, uh, you know, a seven-episode series based on the true story of the escape from the Clinton Correctional Facility? Uh, oh, I'd have always wanted to work with Ben. We, we'd been wanting to work together as director and actor for a long time. And I'd been interested in the story, so I was really excited that to be given the opportunity to work with Ben in, on this material. Uh, for me, uh, you know, I like him as an actor, like him as a director. I uh, met him, and uh, he brought in the script. And what I noticed is that he was fully committed um, and to sound like it's a cliche but to l looking for the truth you know and being as real and as close to what happened as possible was uh, was like the way he approached the the, the whole show and uh, I really enjoyed um, collaborating with him I think similarly, your, your feeling, Ben's other films are really well made, even you know, even the broader comedies than Cable Guy, right? I mean, Tropic Thunder is a really good movie. Um, it's well made, Zoolander, you know, like, the, the, so uh, to me, it, it wasn't that big of a, a leap. Of course, you go, oh, okay, yeah, Ben's other, we know him as, he's, you know, like a, one of the biggest, you know, comedians in the world or whatever, but uh, whenever somebody also gets the chance to sometimes step outside of just a little bit outside of what we think they are, usually there's a good reason for it. And I think it often allows like an artist to really kind of fully express a, another part of themselves. And, and I think Ben did that. I think he did a really incredible job. Also, usually on these things, you know, directors don't sign on for the whole project. They do one episode. So to have that kind of vision throughout, I think you have a real through line of, of the story and the uh, the pacing and everything, the look, all of it.